Good morning. I've been up so long, I nearly forgot to pour my tea out before coming live. And let me tell you, that's not a good thing. Welcome in to the first of today's lives. Hopefully you've caught schedules, all those sorts of things. And you'll know that well, I need locking up really. We're, we're going to have a mad day and I've already been up for four hours. So by the end of the day, who knows what will happen. Um, but thank you for being here with me. Um, if you're here live, do come on and say hello. This first video this morning, we're going to be having a little look at um, the catalogue. We're going to have a walk through. I've got my notes of things to point out. This will be our opportunity to be able to um, gaze and adore those things that I wasn't able to get on pre-order because we need to gaze and adore at those as well. Um, so along with this, we have got various live demos going on all day. If you're part of my um, VIP group, um, my Me Crafty Ducks um, group, if you're one of my customers or come along to my classes, then there will be quizzes and giveaways and all sorts of things going over, happening over there on that page as well. I'm just trying to bring up this live on my laptop, which is obviously being slow, so that I can also share that over to that page. Now what are you doing? Stop, stop, go away. Right, so catalogue launch day, always an exciting day. Um, lots to get excited about. Um, all these new products are now available. We are in very strange times um, and it, I'm sure that it is going to be the case that we are probably going to see more back orders um, and things sort of not quite as available quite as quickly as we are used to. Um, just because, it's, you know, not only is manufacturing been hit, but also um, so is sort of the transport links as well. So it takes a bit longer to get things everywhere. So, for instance, stamping upon able to do quite so much expedited shipping from either from their manufacturers or from the warehouses in um, Utah to the warehouse in Europe. So that all has um, a knock on effect for um, distribution and those sorts of things. So they have doing their very best. There are a couple of things that aren't available as the catalogue launches, some planned, some not quite so. But they will all be coming in as quickly as it is humanly possible for them to get them in, I am sure. So let me just click my comments on who we got. Morning M, morning Beryl, morning Caroline, morning Megan, morning Lisa, morning Jackie. Hello everybody who's come to join us this morning. So let's, I'm going to lift you up slightly. Ooh, just so that with a bit of luck, we'll be able to get a double spread in. You don't necessarily want to see all my gubbings on the side here, rubbish and all of that sort of thing, but hey ho. The new catalogue. Now the first thing I want to say about the new catalogue, apart from the fact that I love it, um, and I've got lots of post-it notes in mine, is the front cover. Now you'll notice that the front cover is sort of perhaps not as busy as it has been in the past. And I don't know if you've taken a look at these um, samples and things, but they're really pretty and they're also really easy to reproduce. Um, you know, if you take a little look at that, that's just some strips of card that's been stamped over. And actually, if you wanted to see that in a bit more detail, flip your catalogue over. Yeah, it'll give you a few more clues about some of the things that they've used. And some of the things that you can get your hands on to shop the project to make those things yourself so that's the first thing the catalogue itself 
it's saying to you right from the word go, you can do this. Whatever is in here, you can do this. So let's flip it open. And inside the front cover, we get the first hint. And if you've got your catalogue with you on hand, do, do join along with me. Grab yours and come along and have a look at yours while I'm looking at mine. And in this front cover, you've got your first hint of your new ink colours. Um, Bumblebee, Just Jade, Misty Moonlight, Magenta Madness and Cinnamon Cider. Woohoo! I remembered. Um, and it gives you a bit of a um, layout of some of the different tools and things as well that you're going to be able to get your hands on to help you do your project. So we've got our trimmer just here and here we've got the, the picker punch um, and it gives you where you can find these things and here we've got our gorgeous stamparatus and down here on these bottom two you'll notice big die cutting machine baby die cutting machine so we're getting a stamping cut and emboss machine and a mini now these two are not available yet they are going to be available within the first half of the life of this catalog we have not yet got a date as to when it would be but what they didn't want to do is not put them in the catalog and then us all have to have flyers and all of those sorts of things so they are there ready to launch and the minute that they launch you'll be able to get your hands on so um, and there are videos and things out there but i won't start confusing you with things that you can't get just know that they're on the way both the big machine and the mini one um, and we'll come back to that. There's some other bits that um, apply to that elsewhere. Now, on this next page, you've got your index of your sweets. Um, not Jelly Babies and Smarties, but your sweets of products. And you'll notice that they've sort of all got a colour. So there's those in colours again. We've got the All Occasion Sweets here that are yellow, that are Bumblebee. We have the Love, Thanks and Support type sweets which are in the Just Jade. Kids and Babies are in the Magenta Madness. The Playing with Pattern Suite comes under the Birthday um, label and that's in the Misty Moonlight. And then down here under the Artistic Expression, um, we've got the Cinnamon Cider. So you've got these colours. Now, why would that be helpful? If you look down the side of your catalogue, you will find those colours. So where's that sweet? It's going to be in this section and you can see there as well it says all occasion at the top of your page. So you've got your sweet your um, index there and you've got your colours coming down the side of your catalogue just there and then in the bottom you've got your different accessories. If we turn over the page again we've got our standard letter from stamping up and that comes us that or we always get a letter from Shelley and we always get pictures of the Gardner family um, so there they all are there's Shelley and her husband um, Sterling here's Sarah who's CEO of the company and her family and the rest of their siblings ch children siblings um, they're all there that's the entire family it is a family company it is still a family company um, and when you join Stamping Up, you actually become part of the family. Um, and here we have our statement of the heart to love what we do and share what we love as we help others enjoy creativity and worthwhile accomplishments. In this, we make a difference. That is the stamping, pumping heart of Stamping Up. And it always makes me shiver. Um, because I love that statement of the heart. Next page, we have um, stamps, the sort of stamps. It tells you a little bit about some of the, um, you know, what you need to know about stamping. Um, here it tells you our different sorts of stamps. We've got our cling stamps, which are our red rubber stamps that have the cling backing on. That means that they stick to your block. And then we have the photopolymer stamps, the transparent ones that you can see through and that um, are brilliant for um, if you need to line things up, precision stamping, things like alphabet stamps are always photopolymer and with any that we need to do this sort of pattern building with. Um, got a little um, index here of some techniques, two-step stamping and a, um, a sort of 
um, an example of where you can go and find two-step stamping on page 27. Markering. Now then, I'd said something about markering the other day. This is the first time I'd heard it referred to in that way. But markering is when you colour direct to stamp with your stamping right markers. So there's some markering and where you can find that. Stamping off when you ink your stamp and stamp it off onto a um, piece of paper before you stamp it onto your card in order to give you um, different variations in colour. Pattern building down here and some examples of some stamps that will do that for you. Some masking, um, masking things off, masking techniques and some heat embossing. So that gives you some ideas of places you can go to see things. And throughout the catalogue, you will find little teaching tips and hints and things to help you along the way. It is not just a book to sell you things. It is a book to inspire you and to teach you how to um, use those things um, that you have bought as well and other things that you have in your stash. Page four is all about coordination and coordination is obviously the um, real thing about any stamping up products, whether it's colour coordination, whether it's the fact that you can get inks and paper and ribbon and cardstock and all of those sorts of things to match that, you know, if you've got, if it says granny apple green on the lid, it's all going to match, whether it's cardstock or whether it's a paper or whether it's an ink, whether it's a stamping blend, um, they're all going to work. So colour coordination is a big thing for stamping up but then we have our coordinated stamps and punches and we have our coordinated stamps and dies so lots and lots there just demonstrating the fact that um, coordination is the thing behind um, it's the thing that stamping up are renowned for it, it, it is it is their sort of benchmark the first sort of products that we get onto in the catalogue are the kits and as always we have a variety of kits we've got our all-inclusive kits which you get a box and you get everything in you can just pick that up and go take it on holiday with you make cards and there's a couple of beautiful kits there that are all inclusive look at this this peony kit is stunning that's what's known as a project kit so you do get your stamp set for that one is separate um, it does show you there, look, this is really useful. It shows you what other, it doesn't only tell you what other things you need, it shows you what other things you need. It's there, sort of in pretty colours, saying these are the colours you need for this kit. And here's the stamp set. So a really nice stamp set. This is full size. This is just giving you what the um, stamp set looks like. There's beautiful flower images in there and that lovely leaf um, for a very kind and thoughtful friend wishing you comfort and peace at this time that's really nice for a um, sentiment card celebrating your day so you can make 16 cards with that kit it comes in this beautiful box for each of four designs um, and yes to so say you'd need to buy the stamp set separately for that one but there'd be 101 reasons why you'd be able to use that stamp set going forward so that's the gorgeous poses project kit and then you've got a product medley now this product medley is just stunning well i think it is um it's these beautiful sort of blue and white it, it's very sort of um dutch delftware like it is just beautiful and so in that kit you get your stamp set you get your dies that coordinate you get a whole pack of 48 sheets of um, designer series paper six by six designer series paper you get these two um, spools of ribbon you get some embossed sheets you get die cuts um, the just is you get these sort of little sequiny bits. It is beautiful. You get the whole kit and caboodle, literally. Um, you don't get instructions. So with your other kits, you get the instructions. With this, you don't. This is just about, here is a whole bundle of coordinated product. Go away and see what you can, let your fancy flee. Go and see what you can make with it absolutely stunning and what's really lovely is you can also buy a refill kit so if you go through all your papers and your um, embossed paper and your die cuts and those sorts of things and you want more you can just buy the refill kit because you obviously don't need to buy the stamps and the dies again 
So that is just absolutely beautiful. I love that um, medley. And that's on my wish list. Um, where do I go to next? I'm going to skip this suite because we're going, that's one of our first lives. I'm going to look at these speciality stamps. Now these are our distinctive stamps. Um, just here and um, the distinctive stamps are absolutely stunning and we'll be playing with some of those later because one of the suites certainly has some distinctive stamps in they're absolutely gorgeous you just stamp with them once but you get that sort of multi-layered effect with them um who else we got morning angie and emma and jane glenda and Carol, hello, just catching up on who's here. So yes, the um, distinctive stamps are just brilliant. One stamp, but you get that sort of multi-tonal effect on them. They're gorgeous. So there's some of them just there, but there's more distinctive stamps throughout the catalogue. And you've got this lovely little mark here that will tell you when you're looking at a distinctive stamp. The other sort of specialty stamp we're showing here is the reversibles. So this um, Mountain Air is a reversible set. So this gives you a solid image. This gives you the detailed image, double-sided photopolymer stamps. They're slightly thicker than the normal photopolymer stamps to allow for that two-sided effect, but just brilliant. And we were playing with the Mountain Air a couple of weeks ago gorgeous stamps so that if you look see this symbol here with the two little flowers on one going one way one go the other that is highlighting that that is a reversible stamp so you'll find those speciality stamps coming through the catalogue i'm going to pay, flick to page 24 so page 24 the world of goods suite we're going to look at that later but from 24 sort of uh, through to page 33 there's a whole host of masculine type stamp sets and there's some really lovely ones so these so this is the suite we're going to look at later these this one is one that's been in the catalog before as has this one but i love this one just here game on with the chess set and the dice and the cards that's a fabulous stamp set for the guys if like me you have campers in the family then the campology one um, will be really nice with its tents and lanterns and things rooted in nature and sailing home we've had for a little while as we, the good man which is fabulous got this really nice leaf set just here really detailed stamps and i think when you see that um, sample just there that's actually a, a box it really brings home just how detailed those stamps are. And then we've got this one down here, Whiskey Business, with your decanter and your glass with the ice cubes in, your lemon rind, your top shelf, this bit of a shelf just here. Fantastic one for the guys. It's nice to see such a nice collection of masculine sets. And you'll have a look up here. We, I just showed you that um, particular um, sample if you look up here they're giving you a color palette so that's another really useful thing if you want to create that yourself you don't need to question what colors they've used it's telling you up there another really useful thing in the um, catalog um, these triangles are really beautiful but if we look down here stitched triangle dies Woohoo! That's obviously a bundle. Really beautiful for creating patterns and things. I like this scrapbook page just here. Really lovely. So the stamp set itself is fab, um, but stitched rect triangles, another um, addition to our stitched um, collection. Now the Playful Pets suite now this suite is not going to be available as the catalogue launches, but I'm sure it will be in as soon as possible. Now what I need to check is whether it's the entire suite that you can't get or whether it is just individual items on it, but really cute. 
um, these lovely little pets and things. So this is one of the ones that I couldn't have this one on play um, pre-order. This is the first of the ones that I couldn't get. But you've got some really fab papers here, real fun papers. Um, you've got this lovely stamp set. I love this one where he's obviously having a scratch. Um, okay, so you've got your cats and your dogs in there. You've got um, dies that go with it which you can see just there and it tells you where you can find the bigger image of them what page you say you've got your papers um, and then you've got some trim some um, different ribbons and things that will go with that so there they are look wrapped around the bones um, so yeah lovely a lovely collection and you've also got these little playful pet trinkets so you've got little bones and hearts and things so you've got like little hearts that they would have on their collars and then these little bones really cute so that's the playful pets um page 48 i wanted to highlight this one um for a couple of reasons one i said earlier about you'll find throughout the um catalog little teaching tips and hints and things um there's one just there you'll also see here it talks about stepping it up so if you're a complete beginner you can start with the easiest card if you're sort of a bit intermediate or you want to try a bit more you could step it up a little bit so a bit of designer series paper behind there and a bit more stamping a bit more greetings and then if you're looking you know if you if you're really quite experienced then you've got the the third step up just there so you can see that those cards sort of vary in the amount of technique and things they've got in there that was watercolored and all sorts of things going on there really lovely but this stamp set just here it's a really pretty little stamp set but that coordinates with that little small bloom punch that some of you may have got during celebration it is now available in the catalogue but if you did get that one then that set um, coordinates with that and you'll be able to stamp and punch out those little flowers hippo happiness look at this it's a very funky it looks very odd that looks such an odd stamp set like what on earth is that about but when you start looking at these little creatures look at these fluttering by butterfly to say hippo birthday to you just gorgeous isn't it i love those little butterflies they're really fun aren't they lovely little um children's stamp set but you know there's a nice unicorn just there when in doubt be a unicorn so really fun little cards thank you so much and again giving you a color palette there of the colors they've used to create those cards and where you see this symbol here that means that a demonstrator who has achieved a million sales um, is um, has helped to design that my little cat next door that I or from next door or wherever he's from that I was watching yesterday has obviously caught something I'm not sure what he's got but he's caught something um, so page 51 blossoms in bloom now this was available on pre-order but i actually didn't get it on this occasion um that's not to say that i won't go back and get it at some point but this gives you two really big beautiful dies and we'll perhaps look at those in fact let's flick across and look at those page 174 see them in a bit bigger i've seen lots and lots of um samples using these dies so you get two sets of dies a bit like the butterfly ones we've got so you've got a um, a large sort of a thicker die just there and then a thinner one and you can layer the two up as well as having all those little flowers in there so that's that die set and then to go with it you have this sort of really watercolor wash type stamp set that goes with it as a bundle um, and they say there's some really beautiful you can see here that that's been stamped and then that's been overlaid over the top there it is just stamped um some really lovely um samples round and about using that set um, so that is the blossoms in bloom obviously i'm not showing you everything i'm picking out my favorites i love this i think that's really quirky look hello 
So you've got H for heartfelt hello and happy. B is for beautiful baby and birthday. C, celebrate, congratulations, cherish. And you've got your is for just there. So you can have C is for congratulations or is for cherish. Or you can just have C and then have cherish. Or you could, um, you could mask the C on the beginning and just use that as your beginning um, of your word. Um, just beautiful. I love that. I've got some more tags there that go with the tags that came out earlier. Um, I said yesterday when I was showing you the snow globe set, we were playing with that on my live yesterday morning, I said that there is a stamp set coming out that is designed for you to use your snow globes with. Here it is. Have you ever seen such an overweight kangaroo? That kangaroo does not do much hopping, I don't think. It's been a that's a that's a quarantine kangaroo that one is, but I love these. They're very quirky. Look at that lovely koala. Obviously, they're meant to be clinging to the tree, um, and that elephant. And you can see here, really fun snow globe um, images. So yeah, so that's the stamp set that's been designed to go with your snow globes. It's a really nice one just here to use your stamparatus with to create these beautiful um, stripes of borders so you can either have borders going around the edge or you can create lots of different borders and it's here it gives you again hints and tips of how you can do that page 70 this is one that's definitely on my wish list this beautiful flowering blooms Aren't those flowering images lovely? A distinctive stamp set look and dyes that go with it. Um, beautiful. I moved beyond words. Your kindness is so appreciated. But just, I love that stamp set. That's really beautiful flower images on there. Um, really one to look forward to. Um, the next one is one of those stamp sets that is very easy to miss. There we are, there's a instructions on stamping it off. This one is called Massive Thanks. This isn't just a thank you card, it's a hug with a fold in the middle. I love that. That in itself is worth buying this stamp set for. Little card, massive thank you. I usually just send a text, but this calls for a card. Yep. Thank you, message on the cover may appear smaller than actual gratitude. I'm one of the thankful ones, you're one of the good ones. Just a brilliant, brilliant stamp set. So if that one has passed you by and you've not seen it, um, I wanted to flag that one up. Just in case you need to make an artichoke card, all things covered. I do like the font in that. I've yet to think why I would need an artichoke card, but there has to be at least one stamp set that makes me think that going through a catalogue. Other people will look at that and go, oh, I've always wanted an artichoke stamp. So there you go. See the good. Another distinctive stamp. I'm sure it stamps up beautifully, actually. The pairs are lovely. Um, yep, so that's that one. Uh, page 81. This is a lovely little bundle. So you get this stamp set and then you get a postage stamp post punch. So there we are, it stamps out this punched postage stamp that obviously lines up with all of these. Post-it note in there, look, that's like, I want that stamp set. Just really pretty. So obviously the stamps themselves don't come with this outline. So you can use those stamps, like this one just here, the flowers in there. But look at this, isn't that lovely? The way that's been layered up. So a great bundle. I like that bundle. I have plans for that bundle. This suite we weren't able to get a pre-order, but it just, I love the colourway of this. I love the sort of petal pink and the grey and the granny, um, the grey granite. Just a beautiful, really soft, um, elegant colourway on those papers. Beautiful peonies. You can see that that dye 
builds up to create this sort of 3D flower. Just really lovely rectangular doilies, um, square doilies, vellum doilies. Just really, really pretty. Some grey granite glimmer ribbon. These beautiful little faceted gems. Just stunning. And when you look at the another distinctive stamp, when you look at the stamp set that's in this bundle, isn't that just stunning? Look at that. Love this. So that looks like it's just stamped in grey granite and the back coloured in. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful stamp set with a matching die and the papers are stunning and the embellishments are stunning. Just gorgeous. Wasn't able to get that, up, that I say, on pre-order. I have um, scheduled a stamping up video to go out later so you can see that a little bit more, but just beautiful. Um, page 91. Nothing better than, here's another bundle, a day without chocolate, coffee, cocktails is like, um, just kidding, I have no idea. Coffee, you make everything better. Chocolate, you make everything better. Today's plan, consume chocolate, cookies, and I'm pretty sure tomorrow will be too, because adulting is hard. Today is a chocolate kind of a day. Great stamp set, dies to go with it. Um, and the dies actually, let's flick to those dies, have actually got um, sentiment dies in there. They're always useful. So you get love you more than cookies, coffee, chocolate, cocktails. So you can just have love you. And then you've got your little dies that cut out your image. And you'll notice on there, You've got a little symbol that says mini and that means that those dies will go through your mini die cutter if you, if you should go for a mini die cutter this big one just here won't but these ones will so it lets you know which dies are going to work with the mini die cutter when that's available another good feature page 93 look at these that's just a silly quirky stamp set but how great are those tortoise monkey toucan ostrich big fat bear nice quirky trees we think you're the best that's a lovely little stamp set this next suite is the one that we're desperately waiting to get our hands on um, whale of a time i love this one um, I have bedding for my grandchildren that has sort of all sea creatures like this on, very sort of reminiscent of this stamp set. So lovely stamp set and die, uh, stamp set and punch bundle. It's a punch that punch. It's a whale builder punch. And um, we've got sequins, designer series paper, six by six pack of designer series paper, a seabed embossing folder. That's really lovely, um, and this lovely pool party sheer ribbon. And look at this bold bright, bright beautiful flower and um, papers just great and there we are there's your stamp set got jellyfish and turtles my love for you is bigger than the ocean got a little seahorse hoping on your birthday fishes come true and then as I say you've got the little whale builder punch that will punch out the whale and fins and a water spout and um, all those sorts of things so really great um, Here's another little, a great little stamp set for the little ones. Moving along, this is the one where it sort of talks about um, two-step stamping because you've got your helicopter and then you've got your stamps that fill it in and your train and your trucks and your road and your car. Um, so really great, a really lovely children's type stamp set. I really love this picture here because this is obviously children stamped and colouring in their own image. So it's not just for children to receive, they're for children to play with as well. And obviously you can stamp the outlines and they can colour those in, but you've also got those um, that two-step stamping. So that's a really nice um, stamp set. This suite here is called Playing With Patterns and it very much is really lovely bright patterned papers. You've got your um, colour 
all the colours there that have been used in it, your colour swatch. Um, and this bundle actually includes an alphabet die and we'll have a look at that in a bit more detail in a minute. So you've got your pretty patterned papers, you've got this stamp set here that sort of gives you these sort of stripes and elements that you can add in to create your own patterned backgrounds. And then the die, let's have a look at that in a bit closer detail on page 178. Here it is. You've got the alphabet, You've got two O's, two I's, two A's, two E's. That's really useful. You've got your numbers, You've got your math symbols, You've got hashtag, all good stuff there. Um, as I say, and that coordinates across with that stamp set. So those, they're not huge, huge dies. There are about 1.9 centimeters, the largest ones, which I can't see my ruler and my pad is on its inch side. Well, which is also what, three quarters of an inch. So about that for the biggest die. So not bad size, but don't think that they're the same size as our big dies that we used to have. They're smaller than that. Quite a good size, but smaller than that, but really useful. So a really useful die set and a quite a good price point as well. So you can get the stamp set and the dies for $42.25, which is a good, a good price set for a point for an alphabet set like that. Page 104 to 105, you'll see these stamp sets in the um, beginner cat and brochure as well, but just cute. These ones you will, the goats aren't in there. Um, but these are new stampers, hey new stampers. So they're, but they're not just for new stampers, but they do give new stampers um, a nice um, starting point in terms of getting beautiful projects. And um, without a great deal of, too much complication, just really lovely. So you've got your zany zebras, you've got this beautiful balloon. I love these goats. Happy birthday, you old goat. <laughs> this one dancing. They just are, got such character, haven't they? They are real good, fun, fun set. 111, look at this, Sending Sunshine. That's a beautiful stamp set, isn't it? You've got your sunset just here that fits into your, your two different your smaller and your larger um, C. So like this one has been stamped in this uh, um, sample so that you only get that sort of top piece, but excellent for uh, creating your sort of stamped, your sponged backgrounds and your different colors, whether it's watercolors or um, just beautiful. That's a lovely, another distinctive stamp set. Another really lovely stamp set. Um, I love this artist that designs these stamps. We've got another one here called Embrace Each Other. So we've had the the ladies and the, the um, we had the wedding one and, and we've had various ones from this artist, but this one is just beautiful. Embrace Each Moment. So really lovely, a bit of a hug. That's a nice one. That would be lovely for all sorts of wedding cards and all sorts of things, wouldn't it? You will always be my forever. So lovely for weddings, engagements, anniversaries, Valentines. Just a beautiful stamp set. Uh, flicking over to page 126. I'm flicking over sweets that um, I've... I'm going to be using this fancy phrases. This is really pretty. So you get there's a brought out a new tag punch. So obviously they're showing you here the other tag punches that are available. This is a new shaped tag punch. Um, and with it is this really lovely in the bundle is this really, really lovely stamp set. Obviously you can just buy the punch or just buy the stamp set. You don't have to have two, but if you want the bundle, that's what the bundle is. This new stamp tag punch and this gorgeous is a really pretty image um, little something just for you keep it in case you need it sometime oh, that's that's a sending a little smile your way keep it in case you need it sometime that's lovely another one here is a wreath um, a ranger wreath bundle so you've got this fabulous die set 
um, that's going to enable you to create lots and lots of different wreaths. And then you've got the things like, so you can create them throughout the seasons. Hearts if you're doing a Valentine wreath, pears, you've got a partridge in your pears. If you were doing a Christmas one, you've got your Easter eggs. Um, really lovely. Um, you've got these sort of little flowery images and leaf images as well all that you can die cut to build up these beautiful wreaths so that's a wreath to take you all through the year Look at these lovely flowers here they're obviously built up out of this um, double leaf stroke um, flower stamp just there like the easter one so that's a really great bundle um, my page, um, Artistry Blooms. This is another stamp set that um, I should be, there'll be a stamping up video posting later, but you've got this great die. So you can have the beautiful whole thing, or you can cut these bits out separately um, so that you can just use the banner pieces like it's been done here. These papers are really, really bright. You can see from that colour swatch um, how bright those papers are. The stamp set that goes with this is sort of like a in two halves bouquet. So you can either stamp it together or you can leave a gap in the middle and have your greeting swirling across the centre of there. Really pretty. So as I say, that coordinates with this banner and blooms die which gives you that big flower this is another lovely one you're going with this die you're going to be able to do die cut plaids that's really fun and a nice generic um, stamp set with that thank you warm wishes for a happy christmas um, to the world you are dad to me you are the world happy father's day so some really um, nice sentiments in there that are going to be useful throughout the year page 134 and 135 i'm just going to let that sit there for a minute there's a duck in the catalogue um i was just slightly excited by that can you tell um lovely stamp sets here i've got this gorgeous little hedgehog ducks this queen anne's lace is really pretty lovely stamp sets for this is in the artistic expression so for adding color to water coloring um, getting the watercolour pencils out, just building up these scenes. Great, great stamp sets. The little ladybird sitting on this leaf, you could almost miss him. Just beautiful. Yep, want those. Another really useful little stamp set, this one just here, Palette Thoughts. You're going to be able to use those sort of that wood effect, I love how, what they've done there with it, look, crisscrossed it to make that wood background. And it's got a stamp in it that says, hello, handsome. And background stamps are always lovely. The birch and the all wild and the buffalo check have carried over, but we've got three new ones. We've got this stacked stone, we've got this dry brush one, and we've got a camouflage one. So here's your dry brush one. That's been done with in multicolours. Here's your camouflage, a backpack that's been camouflaged. Um, really looking forward to seeing the dried stone one as well. So, yep, that's uh, all great stuff. The Make a Different stamp set has carried over really good because you've got all your alphabet, you've got all these things like Deliver To, Created By, etc, etc. And also in there you have got your Stamping Up Copyright stamp. So for the angel policy for stamping up, you can sell projects you've made with stamping up's copyrighted images if they include a copyright stamping up featured in the set above on them. And to more, learn more about that, you've got a where you can go to find that to tell you all about the angel policy for stamping up. But that stamp set um, includes it. Um, back here now we're getting to the accessories and all those sorts of things these are all your colors so the charts have been laid out so um you can see the colors come all the way down they're sort of like the color palette but you'll know that you you know so you won't order that ink refill instead of that one because you'll know that you're coming down the right color so in these 
colour charts, you've got your cardstock, your stamp pads, your ink refills and then also here you will find your stamping blends combo packs. Now our stamping blends are only going to come as combo packs now so you get both the light and the dark when you order them. Melon Mambo is a new colour and you can see as you bring across here which of these have got stamping blends. If they don't have a stamping blend there will just be a dash. Um, obviously the ink colours here are all new so of the five ink colours there's going to be stamping blend combos in four of them and then here you've got things like basic black so you've got your card stock your stamping white marker and your stamping blend combo so you can get a basic black combo but you also get your bronze and ivory comes as a combo um, and your colour lifter comes as a single marker. So you'll find all of those things there. So all your cardstock, all your um, ink pads, all of those are all going to be found in this colour collection just here. If you flip over the page, you get your assortments. So you can get assortment packs of card and you've got your designer series packs. It tells you about your bundles of ink pads, your bundles of ink refills and watercolour pencils, all those sorts of things. So there are all your assortments and bundles. On page 145, you've got your lovely storage things. So that's um, all of those bits so that you can store your ink pads and blends and all of those sorts of things. And um, if we kick over here, you've got all your sort of colouring tools. Um, note the mini spots. So you can now get a mini spot collection and the colours in there are Basic Grey, Coastal Cabana, Daffodil Delight, Flirty Flamingo, Gorgeous Grape, Cranny Apple Green, Real Red and Shaded Spruce. A nice little collection, great if take away with you if you're going out on the crafting on the go. Um, great for your Stamparatus. So really pleased to see that. Um, what else had I got that I wanted to highlight in there? New mark, uh, new paint brushes. So our water painters, so they're not aqua painters now, they're water painters. And you get um, three painters, you get a fine tip, a medium tip, and then this large, I don't know if you can see that, large flat brush just there. It's going to be great. So there you are, there's your fine tip, there's your medium one, there's your big flat brush for painting big areas or stripes that's really great everything else on there I think is carried over we'll have seen before that was the new things on there um, we've got all our papers obviously they're all there you've seen them all in the suites but there they all are in their glory including the um, colour packs so the colour the DSP stacks of the all the colour families plus the in colours You've got your tools, um, packaging boxes. There's um, a couple of new things there. One is a mini paper pumpkin box. That little box will fit our note cards and envelopes. So if you want to make up a set of note cards to give to somebody as a gift, they will fit beautifully into those boxes. You get 10 boxes there. And we've also got some little acetate card boxes that fit three by three. So they're the same size as the mini pumpkin boxes. They're just little acetate ones. So again, you could put three by three cards in there or whatever you like, really. It's just a new size acetate box. Um, we'll be looking at this in a bit more detail this afternoon, but that is beautiful. Other specialty papers that we've got, a velveteen paper pack. That sounds really quite interesting. So that's in cinnamon cider, highland heather and soft sea foam. We've got a new colour foil, the brass foil. We'll be looking at that a bit later. We've got some rainbow glimmer paper. So most of our glimmer paper is gone, but we have got this rainbow glimmer paper. Really beautiful. These doilies are in the peony pack, I think. Um, yes, they're rather pretty. They're vellum doilies. So there's some nice um, speciality papers there. Memories and more. The big albums have gone. The big 12 by 12 albums have gone, but we've still got the smaller albums with the pockets to go with them and cards and envelopes that match the memory and more size cards and there's two collections there the flower for every season and the world of good memories always useful embellishments you can see what are new because you'll see the little 
N next to it, and you find that throughout the catalogue, but lots and lots of embellishments, um, rhinestones and hoops and sequins, um, gorgeous things there. These are our domes, there's a couple of different domes and trinkets, lots and lots to look at there. You take a bit pick tool and all its different accessories are all available there. All your ribbons are on this page just here. Quite a few combo bundles this time so you don't get quite as much on each spool but you get more variety in those combo packs. So some of those carried over but again the new ones you'll see have got an N next to them. Adhesives, we've got quite a few new adhesives this time, nearly at the end. We are doing adhesive sheets. So that's the stuff that you can put on the back of your dies when you die cut them. So the really thin, narrow, um, sticky sheets that you can put through your die cutting machine and then just peel the back off and your dies will stick. And um, there's other things that you can use them for as well, but that's probably the most popular. Um, stamping Seal and Stamping Seal Plus, these are the new um, tape runners. Um, again, there'll be a, something at video posting a bit later. They're not available right at the moment, but I'm sure they will be in stock very, very soon. We're also doing foam adhesive sheets. So that's whole sheets of, um, so look, you can see there, whole sheets of sticky foam. So they've die cut those letters from those to make them 3D'd. So if you were doing something like the... Um, eclipse technique where you wanted those letters raised up perfect and then cling adhesive so cling adhesive is the stuff that you find on the back of your stamp so if you still have some old style stamping up stamps that haven't got that cling on not a cling on obviously but haven't got cling already on them um <laughs> you can buy the cling adhesive or if you had some that's not quite right you can get that cling adhesive uh, page 168, you'll find all the punch bundles. So you, those are your, just your punches on their own. These are the punches that come as part of a bundle. So you can either just get the punch or it tells you about the bundle and you can find where the stamp set is that goes with it, just as you could find the punch that goes with the stamp set. It told you what page to go to with the stamps. It tells you what page. Um, to go to to find the stamp that goes with the punch and the other thing is you get another nice lot of samples in there um, to give you a bit more inspiration you've got a couple of pages here that's going to tell you all about the new machines not available yet but you will be able to have a look and start to get excited about those and then you've got all of the die bundles and there's a big quite a few pages so page 173 through to 179 is all the stamp and die bundles. And there's quite a few, there's a few actually in here that have come over from the, um, the mini catalogue. So um, let's have a look. Majestic Mountains, that bundle has carried over. Um, Painted Poppies has carried over. Peaceful Moments has carried over. The So Sentimental bundle has carried over. So yeah, a few there that have carried over in bundle form. There's quite a few dies that have carried over, but the bundle themselves have carried over in bundle form. And you can see here, as I pointed out earlier, all the mini catalogue symbols. And then we have our embossing folders. You'll see that some of those have been designed to go with the mini as well. At the moment, they're just standard embossing folders. Going forward, there will at some point be some 3D folders, mini folders being launched. But obviously at the moment, we haven't got the machine anyway. Um, but this tells you you've got your 3D ones are in the soft sea foam. The um, ordinary embossing folders are in this jade. And you've got your mini ones that are highlighted. So lots of embossing folders. We get into the back pages. Here's your page about hosting. If you want to host an event, you can see here a little bit about hosting it. 
um, looks good fun nice cookies they've got fruit as well they're healthy um, and you've got up here it tells you all about your stamping rewards and how much you can be earning in stamping rewards depending on the sales of your party and these are the two host sets you can only buy host sets with your stamping rewards if you put in an order that is big enough so if you were to put in a 150 pound order you would earn um, host rewards um, and then you could spend those on the um, on these stamp sets if you wanted to the stamp sets are always well priced so the um, on this one for instance the value is 20 pounds um, but you would only be paying 12 pounds for it out of your stamping rewards as a demonstrator you can also earn stamping rewards so if you're putting in orders you also get to earn those and it, talking about becoming a member of the family getting your starter kit tells you all about it on this back page get discounts and think you buy you can fun way to bring creativity to life um, you don't have to do any classes and things you can choose to do those um, and there will be more things coming up later in the day about that and then in the back you've got your index those are your stamp indexes and these are your accessory indexes um, You've seen the products you love, now it's time to make something. So the kits, the really easy way, this is sort of like a step up. And then if you want to get a bit more advanced, here's some ideas for projects down the bottom there. So here endeth our tour of the catalogue. Um, I hope you've managed to see spot something in there that you haven't seen before or um, added something to your wish list. Um, obviously, if you are a customer of mine or if you don't have a Stamping Up demonstrator and you would live in the UK and you would like to be a customer of mine or you've seen things on there you like, um, do head on over to my website www.loverducky.co.uk where you will find links to my shop as well as links um, to the catalogues and regular blog posts and lots of fun things that you're going to be able to access as well uh, but you'll be able to find links through to my shop on my website um, and head on over there and don't forget to use the host code if you're placing an order that way I know to send you a thank you um, but thank you for round one I will look through the catalogue when we come back, um, we're going to be playing in not very long, actually. We're going to be playing with the first of those sweets. So I'll see you all soon. <laughs>